Well, welcome back. Here we are. Now, this is a little different than our normal. I'm starting a fight right off the bat because after we cut, I was deciding to go to... I don't remember why I went up here. I think it was because they were sieging my place. So I went after the guy who was doing it. And then this guy is deciding he wants to go on after it. So we're going to stop him. He got 80 troops. Um, so we should be able to take him. <laughs> but seriously, this guy has been bugging me. It's like, as soon as I get up there, he was just a little... Well, actually, I'm faster than him. But he had just enough distance between my village and the castle that he kept getting back in there just in time to hide out for a little bit. And then as soon as I was out of range, he'd go back. Oh... He's gonna get a little extra whooping now because of all the torment he's been causing me. Oh, you guys, they're coming from over here, aren't they? Oh my goodness, they are. Um. Oh, they're charging us. Yes! <laughs> I got him. Rex Guard Knight. Okay. Charge, Bashers, charge, cavalry, charge. Okay. Yeah, we're totally gonna go after some bigger guys, though. As soon as we're done with these guys, I just don't want to get my place raided. If I could keep some extra money, that would be nice. Let's load up the crossbow. These guys should get shot pretty soon here. And let's go reload here. Oh, I got another one. Nice. What did I get? A militia. Ah. Uh, okay. Let's go assist our troops here before they kill off our clan rat. No! Gosh. I have no idea where all our troops are. They must be after some cavalry dude. Ah! Oh! Ah! Darn it! <laughs> so many humies! Not enough time. Oh shoot, that's a lot. Okay, I really don't know where all of our troops are. Come on. Okay. Oh, I hear a tomb king. <laughs> grumble, grumble, grumble. And... Yes. Nice. Okay. Don't you run. <laughs> nice. Skeezel? Nope, one of our clan rats. Okay, let's get this guy. Oh, just missed him by the nose. Oh, yes, these guys are pretty fast. So, okay, here we go. Veteran clan rats, they don't have spears? Why wouldn't they have spears? Hmm. It's very odd. I was hoping they'd have spears. Maybe the next rank? We'll have to see. Oh, yes. Well, I meant to get the gunner, but I got a forester instead. Thrud. Oh, yeah, we're totally going to go crazy on some Empire dudes. This is so much fun. The only reason I was kind of holding back was I wanted to get my orcs built up. I didn't have very many tough orcs. I had a lot of warriors, but they can go down pretty quickly if they're mobbed up. Did I not tell these cavalry to go charge? I'm pretty sure I did. Go charge that one guy that's standing right in front of you, then. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so if these rats don't turn out to be very good, if I can't upgrade them enough to really make them survivable with spears, then we'll probably go with gunners. Um, so let's see, we lost two. We lost a veteran clan rat and a mummy. Oh, no! I think that was our last mummy, too. We need to get more of those guys. Let's see. So 8 wounded, 72 killed, he escaped. So we got one Blazing Sun. They didn't have a lot of cavalry, that's fine. Let's get every one of these guys. So, hmm. Question is now, I really need to drop some of these guys off though. Some nice armor. And we gotta get some more food, and oh! That's right. They were going after my place after I was going after some dwarf war bands. Hence why I got so much dwarf and stuff on me. So let me sort through some of this. And I'm just going to quickly make it back to Iron Peak. Hopefully sell the ransom people. And I'll head straight for the Empire. Look for some really tough guy to fight. 
Well, I accidentally stole or <laughs> didn't pick up all the loot I wanted. I accidentally hit the return or whatever button. But we made it here, and there's another feast. These orcs like their feast, don't they? Well, this one is a little special because it said something about marriage. That if your bride's family is here, and I believe... I don't think these guys really got that far. But there's Warboss Grimbar. There we go, we got a happy point. And where is Tulug? Let's talk to Tulug. There's our lady. There he is. We meet again. I heard that you fought and defeated. Yes. May the heavens witness that I'm ready to give you my sister. Orc. Mar. Yeah, you know her name. <laughs> I said, I hereby pledge to be your wife, to stand with you in good times and bad. May the heavens smile upon us and bless us with children, livestock, and land. Yes, Gork and Mark. Um, I pledge the same let us be husband and wife. I don't know. I'm not quite ready for this. The bachelor life. Ah! And we are betrothed, and there we go. I finally got that achievement. I've really never been married before. And I declare you a, uh, to be husband and wife. Go now to the chamber and bear for you. She'll make arrangements for the, your bride to join you in your hall in your hall on Iron Rock. Huh. Very cool. Oh my goodness. Look at this. This is cool. Is that me? I look... Oh wait. Yeah, I don't think that's me. I think. Th Wait, who's this? <laughs> it's all orcs, and then this lady shows up. This is awkward. That's not who I. Oh yeah, that's me. <laughs> Man, that armor must put a lot of weight on me. Look at this. <laughs> uh, what's wrong with my neck? Uh, I must have been hit too many times in the head. <laughs> that's fine. This is still pretty cool. Sigmar, that's that's all wrong. That shouldn't be there. <laughs> I didn't know there was even a cutscene for this stuff. There we go. So, dang. I should go do a, do a tournament. That'd be fun. Um, I could use a little more cash. I went to the tavern. And I sold over stuff. Sadly, there's no ransom broker here. So, I got the veteran night goblin spears. And um, I filled up on some more orcs. So this guy's a wandering Ashik. I don't need you. I'm already wed. Okay. Well, hmm. Do I have any cheap units I could get rid of? Not really. Well, these might be. <coughs> um, but we'll wait. I don't remember how much they're worth. If they're cheap, I give them to the tavern keeper. Make a few extra bucks. Well then, I don't know. I think I'm going to do a tournament real quick. Could always use some cash. I mean, we only barely have enough. So let me do that real quick, and then we're definitely going to go after Sempire. Because I'm all jazzed, because I'm all wet and whatnot. <laughs> okay, I won the tournament. It wasn't too hard. Some of these guys were a little weak. Um, <laughs> he took like one hit, a couple of them. But anyways, I went to our wife, and I talked to her, and I found out something. That you can actually have her hold stuff for you. So I gave her all these cracked metals I don't need to hold on to. I'm thinking we have to gain like one of each kind. I don't know. We'll have to find another tournament someplace else. Perhaps the goblins are having one. I could check that. Decided to give them the horse in this uh, lance because I don't really need it until I can find a companion that actually really needs it or can use it. And that's. Might as well put it there. Um, and this. Let us think of a way to improve our standings in this realm. Uh, you may be aware, my lord, of the quarrel between war. Ooh, Big Boss Grimgor and War Boss Hung Hung, which is demanding the unity or damaging the unity of this realm. If you could persuade the lords to reconcile, reconcile I imagine that War Big Boss would be most pleased. Let's get one of the lords deciding that you have taken the rival's side. Oh, hmm. I like that idea. Maybe we something else. Let's discuss another topic. Okay, so that's interesting. I've never done that before, so that's an option. They do seem to have this trouble where sometimes the orcs aren't actually following the marshals. Like, like they'll send us. Like that one time we did a scout mission, I did it and I came across two orcs. They were just wandering around raiding villages because they weren't listening to the marshal. So let's do this. Let's go to the arena and see if there's any more fights. If not, then yeah, we're definitely going to the empire. But I just thought about that. If we can get maybe another medal. Okay, yes, yes. Can I join two? Okay. 
Right. Um, that is the Lizard Kingdom. That is Dwarf. We can't go there. And Tor and Lick. Okay. That I'm not sure about. Let's take a look real quick. Tor and Lick. Yeah, we can't go into Dwarves because we're at war with them. That doesn't sound like an Empire place. I don't think I've recognized it from being a chaos. Oh my goodness, when did this happen? I've never had that happen or seen that before. They actually took one from the chaos. That's very odd. Tor and Nick. Oh. Oh, it's elves. Okay. Hmm. I don't think I want to go that far. That's pretty far. We can buy a boat in this mod, and it does work very well, and it's very handy for traveling waters. But I think it was like 5,000 gold. And right now we just have enough to pay for our troops and whatnot. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to get food, and we're going to go after some empires. If I can capture more... Oh, speaking of which, I gave Warboss the one of our prisoners. He offered me 19,000. I haven't been getting paid by any of the other ones, so I was like, fine. I get some gold, and I get rid of... Um, of our troops that we've been packing around. So yeah, I'm gonna just skip ahead, find Empire, and let's do some fighting. So I found one. He's not the toughest. He got 62 troops, I believe it was. But he has a lot of uh, cavalry for being so low. He has like 10 Reichsguard Knights, um, almost 10 Blazing Suns, and he has three Warrior Priests, I believe it was. So that's why I went after him, is because he got so many elite troops for some reason. Usually, well, he gets those ones, but that's about it. Um, yeah, where are these guys? Oh, they're coming right over us. Okay, guys, we need to get up on this hill really, really quickly. I'd like to fight some tougher guys, but I couldn't pass up. These guys, and there's a ransom broker. That's the main reason. There's a ransom broker in the castle right next to us. So I can sell these guys off really, really quickly and go after someone else. And I don't have to walk around with them forever. Calvary, I think I'm gonna put you down there. If I can. No, not you guys. Right down there. And infantry stand closer. Yeah, he doesn't have a lot of other good troops, but it's those cavalry we kind of want. I got these bashers. I got another mercenary one. Figured, might as well top off the list. Yeah, we got so many Dane orcs though. So. Oh yes, I love it. Okay. Up to 104 troops. And I upgraded a couple. I'm trying to figure out these rats. I upgraded one of them. Right down here you can see. He's a Molder Pack... Yeah. Pack Master. And he got a two-handed staff thingy. The other version of the Veteran Clan Rats is... I don't see him here. But he got a shield and a sword. So we'll see what happens after that. But I was just kind of hoping to get some spear units for these cavalry to help. But I guess the works do pretty good. Okay, I'm going to let these guys... There we go, Augie Boggy, yes. Okay, guys move right over there. Cavalry, you're not going to really do much in this fight, I don't think. That's big hill you're going to have to charge up. But let's do it. Let's have you go over here. Get ready to charge. Bashers, stand over here. Keep these infantry in front of our troops so they don't get charged or archers. Oh, now they're using this hill. Let's just do this. Let's just charge them now. I'm tired of this game. No more circles. Okay. Boom. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Okay. This may have been a bad idea. <laughs> Get the big guys. Oh shoot, they're going right after those guys. That's fine. If they charge them, then those guys should be able to take them out, hopefully. They got these giant clubs. Biggest clubs I've ever seen. Damn it. And... Oh, I got the horse. Ok, 
Okay, get him. Yes. Okay, Calvary, go ahead and charge. I completely forgot about you. Okay, let's reload. See if we can take out this guy off his horse at least. Oh no, I hate a friendly troop. Okay. Nope. There we go. Okay. Some infantry here. Were? There were some infantry there. Okay. I think, yeah, there's just one guy left. And who was it? Oh, nice, perfect. A Red Scar Knight taken out by a Bone Smasher. Good. Okay. There we go. We lost Veteran Spear and a Black Orc. That's okay. We got more troops. 56, 9 wounded. Nice. 2 routed. Just 5 left. Okay, let's just charge. I'm just going to skip this part. It's probably just some cavalry and the guys are routed. Save some time. I think we have, yeah, we got enough time to do an even bigger fight if I can find somebody. Yes! Got the prisoner. Another one. Um, I'm going to take all these guys. And so yeah, we got quite a few. We got one Rax Guard Knight, two Blazing Suns, Pistoler, and some Empire troops. So I'm gonna sell these guys. What kind of loot did we get? Oh my goodness, another horse. Just can't get enough of these horses, apparently. Some more lances. Hmm. Be nice if we had some troops that could use those, but that's fine. That's fine. I'll sell those, I think. I got enough war horses and stuff. Yeah. So yeah, this is where we were. I just barely got in here. And here is where the person is. So I'm going to go back there. I think. Ooh. I think I want to go in here someplace. Somebody's got to be running around with a lot of troops. Yeah, let me go find somebody. We got five and a half minutes. Let's find a good fight. Well, um. This is very weird. <laughs> I was not expecting this, but um. I was coming over here, I heard some fighting, and I got closer and closer, and look! Known is under siege by the Badland Goblins. They're kicking butt and taking names. Let's Can we actually join in? Yes, we can! Let's do it. They only have a few troops. I can't believe these goblins are doing so well. I really can't. This is just so crazy that they're doing this well. Okay, infantry, follow me. Archers stand over here. I can actually tell these guys what to do, which is very nice. Calvary, follow me as well. Kind of get behind this siege tower. Let's see if I can get a shot off. Yes, carry me. Oh, I almost got him. Oh, nice, a companion level though. Oh, you buggers. I don't know if I'm aiming too high or too low. Never mind, I'm not aiming at anything. Oh, you guys right there. Oh, headshot. Nice. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I'm, I got them spread out, so they're not getting shot too crazy. Archers can stand a little bit closer now. Might save some fighting for these guys. Yes! I saw you peek in there. Okay, I see someone right there too. Ooh. Boosh! Recovery charge. Let's do this. I can't believe there's siege in this big place. Could have been a bigger fight, but I didn't get here in time because I really didn't know they were sieging. Yes! This little guy is taking some names. Okay. Cowers, we're kinda stuck here. Um. Maybe? Nope. nope. I'm not getting any hits in here. I can't get past. I no, I don't dare jump that far. So yeah, stick in the eyes. Go 
Come on, goblins. Let me do something. I've been killed like five guys. Okay, I'm gonna try and. Oop, oop, I fell off. Damn it. <laughs> I guess I could tell them to fall back, but they're going out at so much. But did the archers charge too? They did. I didn't tell them to charge. Archers, get back out here. How many is left? One guy. There we go. <laughs> Goodness. Okay, this makes up for not finding the big fight, right? Us sieging Nolan already? I really was not expecting this. So we lost five, yeah? Lost two Goblin Warriors. Oh no, that's theirs. We didn't lose anyone. We have had a couple of units in there though. And... Yes, now it is green. Sweet. Is anyone in the tavern? There is a ransom broker we don't need and halfling scouts. Okay. Well, that is a very interesting turn of events. If these guys can keep picking on Empire, then maybe they'll get wiped out by the time... No, we're still at war with them. But it could be possible. If the goblins and us wipe out the Empire, then that way we can focus all on the dwarves. Oh, that would be very nice. I'd like to get rid of the dwarves. They're such a pain. Well... I think we're gonna cut it there. That was pretty sweet. A siege. What kind of stuff do the Humies have here? They have guns, of course. These are pretty good. I think our Companion's got quite a few of those. They have swords. Some pole arms. Chipped Empire Priest. Wow, 35 bludgeoning. Heavy crossbow. Okay. What kind of armor do you got? Ah, interesting. Witch Hunter coat, huh? Visors. Look at this. Battered Reichsguard helm open. Hmm. Yeah. It's pretty cool looking armor. Okay. What about horses? I think I know. Yes. Blazing Sun War Horses. Empire War Horse. Very sweet. Well, if they can hold this, which they already got 79 troops in, we could possibly invest into this. Well, look, there's another guy over here. So, yes. Next episode. Uh, definitely, definitely going to go pick on some Empire dudes. They are getting quite weak at this point. That or they're getting rallied up for another fight someplace. But look at this. The goblins just kind of kept pushing this way, it looks like. That's crazy. Yep. See you guys next time.